This is the fake fish. Uh, it was designed to be a soft jerk bait. Uh, we're now using it for flipping, punching techniques. Today we were punching it. Uh, I'll go over the bait a little bit. It's got the hook slots underneath and on the top. That's when we're rigging it to be a soft jerk bait. Today we were rigging it on the flat side because we want the fall to be more subtle. Um, we've been using this now. I've been fishing it back east a little bit, flipping and punching it, and it's just been a really awesome bait. And even using it as a soft jerk bait, I've caught a lot of key fish. Um, all in all, it's just a really good bait. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to show you how we rigged the fake fish uh, for punching. Um, the fake fish was actually originally designed as a soft jerk bait, and we just kind of expanded ways to use it. It's uh, become one of my favorite punch baits along with uh, Mr. Flippy. Uh, I'll show you how I rig it. Uh, pole, you know, rod size, good seven and a half, eight foot flipping stick, uh, pretty stout. Um, I use 65 pound braid anytime I'm punching, don't go any lighter. And I'll show you how I rig it. Uh, first we're going to take our bobber stop, we'll slide it in there, slide it up onto your line, go all the way up, and slide that up, just get it out of your way. And then we're going to take uh, your at one ounce, ounce and a half, depending on how thick your cover is. We're going to put that on, slide that down, get it out of your way. And the hook I use for the fake fish is not the traditional straight shank hook. I like the wider gap with the longer neck on it, just because the bait's you know a lot thicker of a bait. It just seems to set on there, so you don't have to you know tie a snail knot or anything, just go ahead and tie your basic palomar is what I like to do. Always wet your line real good before you cinch your knots down. Now the palomar, I usually like to pull the tag in first down. Cinch it up. Now I'll go ahead and check the main line. Make sure she's tight. Trim off the tag. And I'm going to bring the fish on. And how I like to do it, just start out on the nose. Just like this, come down. I have to take it down just past below the eye. I'm bring it out below the eye. Slide it all the way up the shank, and then you're going to see to where it's going to rest. So it's about right there. Come all the way through to where the hook is sitting flat, and just bury the tip back in. And take your bobber stop and slide it back down. And that's my rig for punching the fake fish.